tiny pig. <laughs> After two years waiting for his forever family and quite a story, this five year old pickle mix and his original owner were reunited at last on Friday morning. I'm ecstatic and it is a bit surreal. Andre Copeland and his daughter Kristen took the 13 hour drive from northeastern Illinois to Plattsburgh to pick up their pooch, Spider, who they originally adopted back in 2011. We're really happy to be reunited with this big man here. Copeland says his ex wife took Spider to New York City after the pair split two years ago. He says she suddenly had to leave and couldn't take Spider with her. Spider was then surrendered to a high kill shelter in New York, which is when All Breed Rescue stepped in. He's so great with people, and he's been great with all of us. And he kind of dug his way into our hearts, and we have been trying so hard to find him a home. <laughs> Spider had been listed up for adoption for over a year at All Breed Rescue in Williston, but he's been staying in Plattsburgh as part of the Balanced Life Canine Training Program that works on dog aggression issues. And after over a year of waiting to find Spider's forever family, CJ Holcomb was working at Allbreed when Copeland called. We had him send the original paperwork, and thank God for microchips because on his paperwork and on ours, they matched. And I knew at that moment that I needed to set this up and get him home. Holcomb says he can't believe it. I am about to cry. Like, <laughs> I don't know if you can see, but Spider is definitely one of my favorite dogs that I've ever worked with. He's one of my best friends. Um, and to know that he's going home is one of the best things ever. Copeland says he can't wait to surprise his friends and family back in Illinois. Oh, I think that's the thing I'm looking forward to the most is just having the family reunited and seeing how happy everybody is. Perhaps it's a miracle or just simply meant to be that Spider will be back home with his forever family just in time for Christmas. In Plattsburgh, Liz Strappa, WPTZ News Channel 5.